All right, stage nine, the treasury. And before I unpause, I just want to say that's a real nice touch to that during the pause screen, those ghosts are still like flying. But anyways, what safer place than next to the catacombs is there to just have piles of cash lying around? You also just get money just random. Gold skeleton, hey, doubles and breaking floors. Man, our bats getting hits in on me. Probably it's better than that. Apparently, I am not. But this music is funky and awesome. And as you can see, that gold is gonna bust when I jump on it. Skeletons made of gold. At least they're not invincible, like in like Symphony of the Night or something, where I think those were gold skeletons, so it's just those skulls. Oh crap, I forgot I was what I was standing on. But I think that's just like a cross or something up there that I'm missing out on. I don't want that dude like getting jabs in on me. Plays really creepy with these busting floors. Hearts. I could really use food. Like, instead of having like a million pieces of food in level one, they could have like put one here, I think. Because I could use it. I I just know they're gonna be like jerks to have like a something in that other one, so we're just gonna book. Yeah. Oh god, they jump! They jump! No! Nothing? Come on, people. Okay, let's... Golly. I just know I'm gonna get hit if I try and go for it. No! I think there's food up there! I can never make that jump, though, so I'm not too disappointed, but watch. Hearts? Food. Here comes food. Yup, food. How dare you. Treasury. Watch, well, I bet there's more... I bet there's more food in that one, but I'm not gonna waste hearts to hit it. Not this time. Got some mad survivability here going on here. I'm surprised I haven't died yet with the level of my health. But hey, 9-2, at least if I die, I start here. What a terrible place for a white dragon. Like, he's not going to do anything there. Ah, if you can see down there, these things will kind of suck you in and they'll pin you down if you get touch them. Awesome. Is there food? Because that's what I need. Stopwatch. Stupid stopwatch. I made that jump. Couldn't make the jump I needed to make. Awesome. No. I still got my doubles, though. Why can't you drop food? Just dissolve it to a bunch of, like, chick... Yes! No! Oh my god, if he got stuck on those stairs, and that food disappeared... Darth Vader saying no. Just that That's just what would have happened. It would have been interspliced into the video. It's what... It, but it didn't happen, so, you know. I'm glad for that. Kind of. Actually, really am. Now, that goal, I believe, is like quicksand gold. It's like Scrooge McDuck's, like, basement. It's like when he goes, like, swimming in gold. That's, like, what that is right down there. So you gotta swing across. Yeah, I'm just gonna keep moving. Coughing. Um, so yeah. 
Oh wow, that almost screwed me over. Stupid wind tunnels. I don't like you. And I gotta run from this dude, I think. Die, 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 die. Yes, die. Thank you. Saying die always makes your enemies die faster. That's a pro tip, too. Just so you know, I mean, when you're playing a game, you just gotta start chanting die just as fast as you can. This is, like, one of the most awesome rooms in the game, though. Because, like, all these candles contain just, like, money, and that one contained food. I think even the enemies drop money. So you can probably catch a one-up in here. But, it is a scrolling pit, so be careful that you don't, like, jump up. Because it's, like, a real finicky, like, scroll. Because you can, like, jump and then, like, land in a pit without even moving. So make sure you don't trap yourself by, like, going, getting greedy and going for that thing. Uh-oh. I think I went the wrong way. <laughs> Yuppers. But we're gonna play it safe and kill this dude. With crosses. Because I do not want to die. Again. Come on, dude! How much health do you have? He's gonna dissolve into a bunch of money bags. Oh my god. I'm so glad I made that jump. Oh man. Oh, man. Such a cool room, though. Just money bags everywhere. It's pretty sweet. Yes! And food. Wow. This place is a lot easier than I remember it. I mean, granted, it's right after the catacombs. So is the cross going to help me? I don't think it actually helps in this one. Oh yeah, those money he drops hurts you. So you got to be sure. Dude, I was just about to say he's not that difficult, but he takes so many hits. You just gotta stand under him, but then you gotta move. Oh, come on, dude! Uh-oh, uh-oh. Mini-bats! Dang it! They're dropping little gold pieces. Just die already. No! No! <laughs> Okay, I could have really used a sub-weapon, but I did net an extra life from that money room again, so... Just gotta remember... Okay, now book. Because he's gonna chunk, he's gonna dive bomb. Let's go. Oh, what, dude? He just takes so many hits. And then those little bats keep dropping those gold coins. Come on, you are an ass. Okay, that's cool. You can keep doing that. Uh-oh. Here comes the mini-bats. Frickin' gold! I don't love it. So wait, if you hit them from, like, the side, they just kind of, like, shit money all over the place? But if you hit them from the... Did I just kill all three of them at once? That was friggin' awesome! Even though I had to lose my triple and my cross. 
Oh my god. No! No, I'm getting showered on by rocks! Are you kidding? You had... That's, that's kind of funny. Jumped up there and then he had to walk back down to the bottom of the... Sorry, that music had me mesmerized for a second. Whew. Stage A. Oh no. But that music. Freaking awesome. I'm ready. Let's do this. 